Sean's View Entertainment right here on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. And the developments and the updates just keep coming. And it keeps getting more tragic as the hours go on. After the AAA pro wrestler died in a match featuring Rey Mysterio. Where Rey Mysterio was not the killer. Rey Mysterio was not the leading cause for this death. It was an unfortunate tragic accident. According to... A-Z-T-E-C-A, Azteca, I guess this must be a news broadcast out in Mexico, in Espanol. I'll post the link in the description so everybody knows about it, because this isn't me just making up stuff. This is the latest news on it. Rey Mysterio was reportedly arrested for the murder of that triple A performer. Now, once again, I just am scratching my head at this. I know they're probably, you know, maybe taking the, 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 the right precautions. They just probably want to take him in for questioning. But remember yesterday that I brought up the uh, report and gave my view and my opinion under fair use of the fact that Rey Mysterio, it, this thing was being searched, investigated as manslaughter. Manslaughter. And I brought up the definition of manslaughter right here on Sean's View Entertainment. And this is the kind of thing where it just doesn't add up. When you sign that contract, when you get involved in the wrestling business, and when you perform in that ring, you know the circumstance. You know the risk. You know what is involved. You understand the bumps, the bruises, the injuries, the time off. You understand how taxing it is on your career being on the road, hotel to hotel, airplane to airplane, being away from your family, and even in unfortunate circumstances, very rarely do you hear about a death in professional wrestling, but this was a tragic state of affairs, and it's an unfortunate state of circum uh, uh, circumstances, which right now I am completely confused by this. I'm a little shaken. I was kind of worried when they started talking about manslaughter. It's not like Rey Mysterio wanted to kill the guy. It's staged. It's planned, although the moves aren't really all that fake, but I wouldn't blame what Rey Mysterio did on this AAA performer dying. Now, I understand that this AAA performer was a big deal, and I understand, actually, you know, come to think of it, I heard about uh, live event results of a, of a I guess it must have been a show in Japan or Mexico or whatever. Um, something to do with this AAA performer who we all know is now dead. They're already making a storyline out of it. They're already making an angle out, of it, angle out of it. They reportedly did a 10 bell salute to this AAA performer. And uh, some wrestler came out. I read this on Facebook last night. The results, I don't know what show it was. You can go search it up on Google. They're already making an angle out of it. After they were doing the 10 bell salute, paying homage to this wrestler, he, the 10-bell salute was uh, interrupted at the 9-bell salute. So they're already making an angle out of the guy's death. Can you imagine that? Now, that right there is kind of sick and twisted. I understand they're trying to get heat. I understand that they're a heel. I understand that they're a bad guy. But that, in my opinion, it's too soon to start an angle out of this. It's a little bit repulsive. Just like when the WWE, you know, made a storyline out of Eddie Guerrero's death and how people mocked his death and, you know, Randy Orton and, and stuff like that. So this this right here boggles my mind. I, I'm scratching my head at this one. Rey Mysterio in jail over the murder. So they're really taking this thing as Rey Mysterio killed the guy. Are you kidding me? Ridiculous.